turn this thing on. There we go. What's going on, guys? Um, so if you've been following me on Instagram, you may have been wondering where I am. And you might also be wondering, whatever happened to that human flying drone project I started? So, uh, yeah, let's just jump right into it. I'm gonna try and keep this short, not too much talking, no, like, excessive jokes. Because, you know, uh, ain't, ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that! Really? Is that, is that where, is that we're gonna start this video? A dead meme? Yeah, I'll drop a Harambe reference right now. I ain't no bitch. Ooh, and I swore too. Australia's making me edgy. Wait, I haven't told you where I am yet. Uh, this whole video's, this, this video's going to shit. Pretend, pretend like you didn't hear that. True, so uh, how do I say this? Yeah, I'm, I'm in Australia right now. Oh yeah, it must have been a crazy night. <clears throat> I think people were bringing snacks into movie theaters. Walking to the movie with my pants full. You know, I think someone actually took out a USB stick without ejecting it. <laughs> Yeah, somehow ended up here. I actually hinted at this in my last underwater drone video, and the plan was to actually have the first video here be the testing for that drone video. I was gonna do a whole like trip montage and whatever. Um, it's gonna be super cool, but unfortunately the water right now is too murky for me to test it, so I'm gonna have to postpone it for a little bit. But just promise me you guys are gonna watch it when it comes out. So we're gonna do some other projects in the meantime. I've actually been doing a lot of cool filming. Um, here's a little teaser of that. Yeah, got a lot of cool stuff, so, you know, subscribe. Also, comment what you guys want to see. Um, pre preferably anything that gets me outdoors or anything like Australia-related would be kind of cool. So as for the drone project, well, I'm here, and the drone is like 2,000 miles that way. So that's where I'm at right now. But I did do some work on it before I left. Filmed one last part, kind of. Um, so here, here's what happened with that. Freaking car alarm. Trying to make it seem like I'm in the jungle here. You know what? Fine. There's a building right there. You got me, all right? So here's what's going on. In the last drone video, I broke a couple propellers. Finally just flipped over and landed in the snow, as you saw. Tried to test it out to see what would happen. You know, send it, why not? So naturally, I thought for this video, I'd try and make some propeller guards to prevent that from happening. Also, put the flight controller in GPS mode, as a lot of you guys suggested. Turned down the sensitivity, just basic stuff like that to try and get this to fly. Perfect. Sounds like a solid video. Yeah, did not go as planned. So let me tell you a little something about propellers. Propellers aren't all the same, okay? They're people too, they have feelings. There's large propellers, small propellers, white propellers, black propellers. So the type of propeller I needed sold out, my prop guy fell through. Zero props to him, by the way. <laughs> Come on, give that one to me. Up top, up top. Okay. So I had to basically dive into the depth of the internet, pretty much go into the matrix to try and find one of these propellers. Finally, I found one on that worldwide garage sale we like to call eBay. I'm highest bidder! Oh, and there's the Harambe reference. And finally, guys, it got to me after three weeks because it got held up in customs. That's <laughs> not have been a white propeller. So yeah, I literally got it the day before I was supposed to leave. So I didn't know what to do because I really wanted to test this one more time before this project was put on hold for a while, obviously, because I couldn't bring it on the plane with me. And I'd already built the prop guards and everything. Everything was set up, the GPS, everything was calibrated, just waiting on that propeller. So in logical J laser video fashion, the best thing I came up with was to purposely try and crash this drone. The scientific reason is by testing this with three propellers, we can test out the prop guards and see how this will react if we do crash. So here's the montage of me building the prop guards because I already edited it. And I swear to God, guys, if the audience retention dips, I am only doing Fortnite reaction videos. Got the aluminum to build the prop cages. Let's do it. The place we shoveled kind of turned into an ice rink. This is the last time we tested this. Also, sorry I'm doing this at night, but again, I'm leaving in the morning, so... Uh, you know, it's now or never, pretty much. So let's put on the propellers, the propeller guards, and the batteries. Oh, right, so we have everything set up. As you can see, the propeller guards out here. It's over sideways or this side. Hopefully these things will come in contact with the ground and uh, stop the propellers from uh, getting destroyed. At least that's the plan anyway. I'm just gonna go ahead and tip this on its side real quick just to see if these things work at all. This way. Those will hit the ground first. So uh, I guess there's not much left to do except uh, fire this thing up and um, try and crash it. <laughs> All right. 
Let's run it. So honestly guys, I'm just happy that the prop guards worked and nothing broke. So that means we did something right and we're on the right track. But I am super bummed because I didn't actually get to try it out for real. Because I think it would have worked. Granted, I'm nowhere near ready to get in it, but I think it would have flown. Go check out my Instagram if uh, you want to keep up with the adventure. See where I am. Also subscribe, comment your ideas down below, all that stuff. Anyone knows where I can get some good quality propellers, you know, let me know. Because, uh, you know, I, I, I need my fix. And lastly, remember guys, if at first you don't succeed, then don't go skydiving. Pretty sure I read that on a Snapple lid, but um, I don't know. It was something like that. <laughs> All right, bye.